okay hello and uh, today in this video we're going to talk about how do we create or generate classes from a visual URL so sometime working with so what happened is a visual URL is given to you and you might need to use uh, the classes of the third party or something and then you might need to generate classes out of, out of that visual URL so today we are going to talk about how do we generate classes from a given visual URL so for the sample I just found a dummy visual URL over web and um, I, I, I just checked that uh, this visual URL uh, shares the country information and uh, I, I just appended uh, a question mark WSDL in this URL uh, in order to make it a visual URL and I copied this and um, let me maybe create a new folder uh, where we want our classes to get generated so let's name it as simple WSDL or something and uh, so okay I'll be using uh, WS import command to generate the classes from the visual URL and for WS import command to work in your system uh, you first need to set Java home on your machine so I'll tell you how do we set the Java home in Mac machine you'll be opening um, opening a terminal and in that you need to open your bash profile the command for the same is open um, space uh, dot bash underscore profile and uh, there it is open for you so in my machine it is already set and uh, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll copy this uh, um, command and paste it in the description box for you to use it so if in case you haven't set it for you you can use this command and you can set your Java home like this you can save it and you can quit from here so my Java home is set now I'm all good to use WS import command uh, I'll, I'll be opening a new terminal here on this empty folder and um, I'll be using a WS import command okay I misspelled import I M P O R T and space and uh, you have to give the visual URL in quotes and um, if you will not give it in quotes it may not work for you so be careful while you give uh, visual URL it has to be in quotes um, so okay it has generated the code let me check so it has generated all the code with correct directory structure and here are your dot class files that I just got generated from the visual URL so sometime what happen is uh, in order to use those classes we might need to create a jar out of this and we might you uh, we might need to use that jar in our project so I'll also tell you how do we create a jar out of these classes for that uh, we have a simple command I'll open a terminal at this folder where all our classes and directory structure is there and I'll be using jar space cvf space uh, you have to give the name whatever name you want to give to your jar let's say simple uh, simple jar underscore one dot o dot jar then space then asterisk and it should be creating a jar for you so if I check and in this folder so you see this jar is created there and now you're all good to use this jar in a project so this is how we generate classes from a given visual URL and also we can generate a jar out of that visual URL so thank you so much for watching this video I'll be pasting um, uh, whatever commands I've used in the description box you can use that if you need thank you so much for watching it bye bye